All right. Okay, welcome along. Uh, Easter Monday, our workout. Um, we'll be going four times through. Hope you all had a great Easter and not too many choppies and all that sort of thing. Um, so we'll we'll get into it. We'll have our our jogs, some warm up, and then um, our our circuits. So let's uh, let's get going. All right. So some moving on the spot. So if you're like me, you try to eat all your Easter eggs in one day. All right. That way you only have one bad day for the week. sweeping action, All right, so we're down the ground prone position, foot up nice and high, and we're down, bring your foot up, reach it under, reach it up, reach it under, reach it up, stay on the one side and we'll go for five. Slow. And back down to the middle. And we're up. Okay, one we did last week, hands together, I'm going to squat it down, open and sweep, back together and stand. Alright, alternating sides. Alright, squat it down, open and sweep, and back. Make sure your head follows your hands, all the way around, so your chest opens up. We don't just do that, we want to see rotation through your shoulders each time. Ground. 
and then touch the ground. One more right side. Very good. Okay, prone crawl on the spot. So two step forward, two step back. All right, so we start prone, opposite hand and foot. So one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Two, one, two. Okay, if you've got your band, please go and grab it. And let's pop it around our feet, just below, and then onto our legs, just below knees. Okay, so what we're up for is feet are shoulder width apart, hands and ears. Try and squeeze our shoulder blades back together. So we don't want our elbows forward, we want our elbows back. And we're going to sit into a squat. So we're up here. And it's quite hard to keep a balance. So I'll give you a side view. All right, what we're after is 20 squats. Now you're going to be your legs a little wider than the shoulders and your toes out just a little bit if you want. It's going to help you stay a little prouder, a little taller. Alright, so let's try and keep try and keep that technique the whole way through. So hands up. Now be sure you're not pulling behind your head. Alright, it's just out here because we don't want to be there. We're gonna up, elbows back, the whole way through. So let's keep it going on our way to 20. Two more. Hold on. And off. Okay, we didn't have push ups last week on Wednesday. We're going to bring back a push up today. What we're looking for is slightly faster movement on the way up, and it's just a little jump and movement with your hands. So we want to do 12 push ups, but they'll be a little bit quicker than they've been. Okay? Let's give you a bit of an example. So I'm here, I want to touch. Okay, so we're not actually stepping to change, but we're jumping with our hands. Now if that means you need to go to knees, it's fine. You go to knees. I'm looking for 12, so raising up our number by two. Let's go. And Two. shadow this time, we're actually going to move back with the back leg. Now, what we're after is back and down, both hands to touch, and then knee up high. Might stay in balance between each one. So, I'm back and down to knee up. 
We're looking for eight and eight. We don't actually touch the back foot on the ground though. All right, we just reach it back. Try and keep your chin up. Back nice and straight. The movement comes through your hips and your knees. Let's go. So pick a leg you want to start with. We're going for eight. Down. One. Two. Shake, change legs. I call our single leg work well. Let's go try our knees. So make sure we're keeping it out and it's not collapsing in. Okay, if you've got a mat, please grab it. I'm going to lie down on the mat. Give a little, a little sit up variation. So I've got my knees bent at about oh, 90 degrees more or less. Heels touching the ground. Hands on thighs. I'm going to sit up to my wrists, touch my knees. And then I'm only going to go down to my fingertips, touch my knees. So it look like this, straight arms, wrist, fingertip, wrist, fingertip, wrist, fingertip. And we want to try and keep a nice straight back throughout. Try not to be there. Okay, so squeeze your shoulder blades back together. So we're going for 15 wrists to knees. Straight arms, hands on thighs, and we're up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15. All right. Next one. Sort of like a deep block jump. Yeah, probably a little bit deeper than we normally would. So we're going to squat down. We're going to touch the outside of our feet. Then we're going straight up into a jump. And I want you to jump somewhere and move all the time, forwards, backwards, sideways, maybe a little turn. Land soft, start again. We do 12 jumps. Okay, so something along the lines of this squat it, touch, jump, one, two, three. Last one for me. Twelve. Make sure we're landing on both legs, not just favouring one or the other. Okay. We're down to prone again. We're doing a prone horizontal squat. So we're in a prone position. I'm going to bend my knees 
and hand off and touch the other knee. So prone and a bend and a touch and come back up. Probably doing it down in push-up position. We're looking for 16 alternating, so it'll be eight with each arm. So prone, squat, bring your knees really close to the ground without touching. I'll give you a side view. Squat it, touch knee, come back to straight. Don't come back to here. Don't come back to here. Nice and straight. Alternate sides. Back to straight. Three. Four. Five. Six. So we're going to alternate a small forward lunge. We're going to go two sets forward, two sets back. So look, it's only a small little step, and all your weight's got to get onto that front foot. We drop and touch, drop and touch, and we come back, drop and touch, and only one more with it. Drop and touch. So two forward to two backwards. Right, get for. What am I doing? That's wrong. Ignore that. We're doing a forward curtsy lunge. So last week we did a backwards curtsy, this week forward. Hands on hips, forward lunge, and come back up. Alternate sides. You can make some quite short, some really wide. Right, we're going through for 20. Alright, on four already. Give you a bit of a side view. So vary the length and the width of the lunge. Change view. Making sure your feet point forward, both feet. So don't turn and face the lunge. All right, my foot is still facing forward and I'm down. side walk. Some of us have already done this one before in the Pilates or in one of the strength programs. Feet together, hands apart. Hands together, feet apart. Feet together, hands apart. And back. One, two. One, two. One, two. But we're prone on the ground. So obviously he's just tummy in our shoulders. Alright, we want 20. Turn one way, turn the other. Let's go. Feet together, hands apart. Hands together, feet up. There we go. So one and two and three and four and five. Okay, next we've got some split jumps. So we're going to go into not a long lunge, a medium length lunge, something like that sort of line. We want to drop, we want to touch the ground with the hands, and we're going to jump straight up and split 
change the feet. Each time we want to do a series of six, then we rest. We only do three series of six jumps. Okay, so pick your foot full, we'll come down, touch, and jump, and jump. Alright, does that make sense? So let's do a series of six and then we'll rest. And one, two, three, four, five, six. And breathe. Let's be really careful of knees, as we always are, not collapsing in, being very precise in what we're doing. Let's do another series. All right, so we're here, and one, two, three, four, five, six, rest. <clears throat> All right, we're going to go in, last series, and one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, grab your mat. So we did the doggy wee last week. Now, this time, same position to start, hands on the shoulders. Knees on the hips, but instead of side, we're going straight up. I'm going to start there. Now I want you to imagine you've got a cup of water sitting on your heel and you're just trying to lift that up towards the roof. Okay? We're doing 12 on one side and then 12 on the other. Now when we're doing it, it's important when we're doing it by using your back. Okay, so I want my butt to be doing the work. I'm here, little lift, little lift. Make sense? Let's do it for 12. So pick a leg, and one, two, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Switch. One, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right, two minute break, grab a drink. Good start. Mm. Assuming school starts tomorrow, so if you're going to school or not going to school, make sure you keep up your activity. If the school offers you some instruction stuff, that's in addition to what we do, certainly not instead of. Um, make sure we keep our sessions going. Um, if they work at five, good. If they don't, you can always do it at another time. It doesn't have to be when it's live, because uh, you can always pick it up on Facebook if, if you haven't been able to do it. <clears throat> I hope something yummy is coming for dinner. I've got chicken korma on the stove for the last two and a half hours. It's going to be a ripper. I can smell it in the gym at the moment. Throughout the week, I'll also be filming some training that we can do volleyball wise. So, if you've got a volleyball at home, then I'll start uploading that throughout the week. And then for next week onwards, there'll be some um, skills work for you to do at home if you've got a volleyball. Alright, so I'm all going to be, well, it's not going to be amazing volleyball, but it's going to be something to keep you entertained and keep you touching the ball. Alright, we're going to start again. 
So let's have bands on. Feet a little wider than the shoulders. If you want to point your toes a little bit out, that's fine. Hands behind your ears. Certainly not gripping behind your head and pulling your neck forward. Okay. So we've got tall, tall chest, tummy strong, hands behind, fingertips behind ears, maybe just on the side of your head. And see you on your squat. Let's get 20. Keep those elbows back, even when you're getting tired. Two more. Right. Okay, push up. Smooth change. Wide, skinny. Hands high, turn them in, turn them out, wherever you want to go. A few ten, 12 pushes. Let's go. And. Squat. Uh, sorry, Brady, for buffering. Um, switch to Instagram. I think it works a bit better rather than Facebook, if that's possible. All right. One foot. Pick your foot. Squat it down. Touch the ground. Knee high. Make sure we can try your knee. No collapsing in. Two more. Last one. Eight. Going. All right, cover your mats. Straight, 15 times wrist to knees. One, Whoop. two, three, no.
13, 14, 15. Okay, we have 12 jumps with lateral spinning movements, forward, backwards, wherever you want to go. Making sure we catch nice and softly and we control our knees on the, on the jump but also on the landing. All right. So we're on squat, touch the ground, and jump, soft land. One, two, three. Well, okay, prone position, the squat back and touch the knee. To make this one harder, take your hand off the ground earlier before the squat and then work the shoulder chain a fair bit stronger. Okay, on 16, uh, 16 alternating sides. Let's go. So knees down towards the ground without touching the ground. You want to make it harder, hand off, then squat. All right, forward lunge with the curtsy. So hands on hips if you want to make it harder. Hands across chest. Make it harder again. Hands on the head. All right. Let's go. Or even hands behind the back. Oh, like hands behind the back. And 20. Make sure your feet are always facing forward. Two more, 19, 20. Okay, prone side walk. Feet together, hands apart. Hands together, feet apart. Feet together, hands apart. Moving back and forth. All right, 10 each way, so we one, two, three, up to 20. Let's go. And one, and two, three, Nineteen, last one. Eight.
Hopefully you're getting the sweat started. Oh, split jumps. All right, so not too long a strip split. Three series of six. Let's get nice and high. Yeah, really bounce it up. Okay, here we go. Touch. Bang! One. Six and rest. And again. Two down, one to go. All right, last one. And two, three, four, five, six. Whoa. All right, that's back. Lifting the glass of water. That's placed on your sole. It's on our knees. Hands on the shoulders. Back nice and straight so don't sink and don't raise. Mutual everything. New side view. So we don't want to sink here. I don't want to raise here. I want to be nice and controlled. Put off the ground. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Change legs. Two. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Alright, two minutes rest, have a drink. I think Facebook cut out, so excuse me coming close. Seems my internet's not that happy. Instagram, I'm just gonna start, stop you and start you now, so we don't have to do it next time. All right, well, I'm getting the Facebook back. All right, so I'm just gonna stop, and then start again straight away. Just trying to get Facebook back up and running. Seems to have got a bit upset. Everyone watching too much Netflix, I imagine.
Just trying to get Facebook back everyone, so just hang on a sec. Okay, we can start please, so grab your band. Let's start with fingertips behind head on your 20 squats. Alright, so. And on knees. And we've got hands up behind ears. Let's go. Two more. Twenty. <clears throat> All right, push up to twelve. Moving our hands each time. Facebook has totally lost it. All right, twelve pushes. With the variation, please. Chest and chin to the ground. Single leg squats, trying to get both hands to the ground, then up on the high knee. Alright, so we're balanced. One, keep going through that, I'm just going to play with the video. All the way up to eight on each leg. Keep it going. I ain't changing legs if you haven't. Oops, and balance. Okay. Alright. Lying on the back. Wrist to fingers. 15 with control. Trying to keep your back nice and straight. No slouching and slumping. So hands on thighs, Move up, wrists, fingertips, wrists, fingertips. Two. 
12, 13, 14, 15. All right, jump squat with a twist. So on 12 squats, getting up nice and high with that turning movement. Always balance when we land and catch. All right, let's go. So squat it, touch the ground with two hands, and explode. One. Two. Three. Four. Okay, prone position with the squat. Right hand touch left knee, left hand touch right knee. The earlier you take your hand off, the harder you'll make the exercise. All right, let's go. Prone and one, two. So a race control. One more for 16. 16. Hips. All right, curtsy lunge. Forwards. I'm gonna go hands behind backs again. So, my hands behind my back. Curtsy lunge. Two more. Very good. All right, prone side walk. Side to side movement. Feet together, hands apart. Hands together, feet apart. Feet together, hands apart. That'd be one. Back and forth on the two step. Going for 20. So, feet together, hands apart, hands together, feet apart, feet together, hands apart. One, two, three, four, five. Don't step too big with your feet. Jumps. Three series of six. 
nice and smooth, nice and high, fast off the ground. Woo. Let's go. And one, two, three, four, five, six. Nice and tall with your chest, not slumping down. Keep that good technique. Let's go again. One more set of six. Well, like 30% of weight on your front foot. Sorry, 70 on the front, 30 on the back. I'm really trying to push hard to jump up as high as you can. Tired coach. All right, let's go. And drink. One more series to go. I think Facebook's totally offline now. Bloody hopeless. Sorry, Facebookers. So, drink one more time through. So if you don't have a volleyball at home, be great idea to get one. abw.net.au, the uh, Australian Volleyball Warehouse. They'll get one delivered if you want a, a real one, a Macast or something like that. <clears throat> if you want a cheaper one and you can get them for oh, 12, 20 bucks at Decathlon, go to decathlon.com.au. They have the various um, levels. So. Uh, certainly uh, AVW from a castle or, or a joust ball. Uh, if you want a cheaper one, go to a decathlon or just go there. Uh, but I guess we're supposed to be ordering online at the moment. And being careful about going out. <coughs> <coughs> oh, I can smell the curry. The korma, glorious. So let's go and turn it down. I'll be back in one sec. So bands on. <sighs> All right, hands behind ears. Touch the side of your skull if you want, but please don't interlock your fingers because we're on the risk of pulling your neck forward. All right, so you want to stay nice and tall, squeeze your shoulder blades back behind you. All right, 20 on the squat.
head up, elbows back. Okay, 12 pushes. Last one of 12. Let's vary it. All funny sort of different ones. Get okay, a little jump to each one. 12 reps. Chin, chest, must touch the ground. Chin's the thing at the bottom of your face. Not far off the top of your face, chin the ground. Let's go for 12. Alright, you got your 12 finished, we're up, and we've got single leg squat, trailing the back foot, but not actually touching it to the ground. So double hand touch on the ground, and knee up between each one, eight on one, then eight on the other. Control the knees. Try and keep your chin up. And change legs. Ooh. Bum burning. Where are we? Ooh. Right, mats. Wrist to fingertips here. So on the back. Hands on thighs, and then up to wrist, down the fingertip. Alright, jump squats. We have twisting movements. 12. Both hands getting close if not touching the ground. And some rotation, some lateral stuff. Alright, let's go.
Okay, prone squats with hands touch the knee. Alternating side for 16. Make sure you stick your bum in the air or sink your hips. We'll give you a side view. So, prone. Bend the knees, touch the hand. Hand touch the knee. Between each one. Straight legs, bum down. Oh. All right, curtsy lunge, hands on hips, hands on back, hands on shoulders, wherever you like to have them. And we're on for 20. Try and stay nice and upright. So I'm trying not to lean forward. Eighteen, two more. Nineteen. Twenty. All right, prone side walk. Hands together, feet apart. Feet together, hands apart. Cross and back, looking for twenty. Ten each way. So two steps is one. Let's go. One, two, three. Not too big with the feet, remember? Alright, split squats. Big jump. Oh, 70% of the weight on the front foot, 30% on your back foot. Six reps. Rest. Three times through. Nearly there, two more exercises. Being calmer. Get to six. six. 
Last one for six. And that's lifting the glass of water. So a neutral spine, we're going to move our body around. And one, going for 12. And switch. Twelve. Oh, very tired, everyone. Let's go drink, have a little stretch and a little chat. So, as I was saying, we have Monday, uh, Wednesday's workout, Friday's recovery is 11 o'clock. If that conflicts with school, you can do it outside of school time. And then for next week, um, I'll be sending through a volleyball training for home. All right, so if you haven't got a ball yet, please get one. I'll shoot an email to parents about getting the ball. Let's go up into a wide leg, not too wide, it's wide enough. And then sink. So two best places, ABW and Decathlon. Get those hammies, reach across to one side. Let's go to the other side. Okay, down for glute. So one leg forward, one leg way back, and try to get chest down to knee. And switch. Angry cat, happy cat. Flexing up. And flexing down. Oh. Up. Open the rib cage. Open the shoulder blades. Down. Close from the blades, sink the rib cage. us thank you very much for tuning in please give us a like give us a wave give us a comment uh, and I'll see you Wednesday and then uh, Friday and next week we will start with some volleyball training as well as our fitness stuff um, Academy kids your parents will get an email from me uh, great job and thank you very much enjoy dinner